Hello, Tab Nation. It's your boy Tom, and today we're not going to be learning about coding, but resources that have to do with Tab Nation. This is just a way to kind of get it some useful stuff out there. Some of it will be outside of Tab Nation, but still helpful for to you, uh, for you. Uh, so yeah, just a real quick video. Let's uh, take a look at all this stuff I got. So I'm calling this the Tab Nation Universe, if you will. So first I have my website and obviously all these links will be in the description below. Um, a lot of these are also in my about tab on my YouTube channel. So if you want to go there also, you can find them versus having to find this video at a later date. So tab nation, just a quick run through. I'm not showing you everything, um, but basically I got like news links to different things here, uh, video and code. You can come here and search, you know, my code, you can type in like loop. Here's, uh, you know, uh, intro to loops, uh, stuff like that, common issues in gaming, and how to use loops in gaming. Uh, so you can do a lot of searching here, uh, and that will directly go to the video about it or the code uh, that is involved in it. Uh, helpful links. We got auto hotkey links. Uh, I won't go through some of these just because they're there. Some scripts that I like that I've designed or someone helped me with. Uh, auto hotkey programs. Same thing, basically, just, you know, some programs with pictures. Uh, coding editors, you know, I took, like, I think, the, I forget what it was, top 20, 30 or so. Uh, just with, like, you know, here's Notepad++, here's a description, here's the download link that you can go to. So here's a bunch of different a, um, coding editors, IDEs, whatever. Uh, let's say you want to jump up in your uh, coding experience and you actually want to get, like, certified in something these are called boot camps, and these are some of the most popular uh, around the world, uh, depending on what you're looking for. Uh, so check those out if you ever want to get like some type of certification. It's great for jobs. And then the last one was programming channels. Let's say you want to expand out of auto hotkeys. Check out the YouTube channels. These are a bunch of the channels I found that are uh, pretty uh, active, have a lot going on. Uh, you can look, uh, say you, you want to, you know, hey, I've mastered HK. Let's learn Python. Type in Python, and here's a bunch of channels that have a decent amount of content. Now, you know, like this one right here, they have Python and JavaScript. They might do other languages, but from what I can tell, these are like the two main ones where that's mostly what their channel is. Kind of like I do other languages on my channel, but my main focus is auto hotkey. That's kind of what I went for in this. And then visit will just take you to their YouTube page. Uh, for hire, obviously, if you need help with something, uh, that's going to be more for, like, company people. Uh, FAQs is probably the most visited page on my website. FAQs up here, you got some of the most asked questions, uh, which is some breakdowns. Uh, one key activates two others. Code sample, brief description, how do you save data, you know, it talks about INI &I files, that kind of stuff. Uh, but this is seems to be where most people like to come for is game info list. Uh, AHK is very popular in gaming. As always, I tell people, you know, don't cheat. If you're playing single player, do what you want. But you can look at these different things like Diablo 3. You know, and it just has hints and tips on, you know, will it work? How can you make it work if you run into problems? So with Diablo 3, like, you need small sleeps between up and down events. Uh, it has to be in window mode or it won't work. And uh, it does pretty good with rapid key presses, so meaning your sleeps don't have to be huge. They could probably be like 50 milliseconds. But yeah, we got a bunch of different things in here. Uh, you know, Final Fantasy, you got to use uh, use hook. Uh, Windows 10, 10 users need the script in administrator mode to run. Uh, stuff like that. So that's my website. Check it out. Visit it. Bookmark it. I would love that. Next, we got TikTok. Yes, I have a TikTok for some odd reason. And this is basically just any video I upload that's less than eight minutes. I've been throwing on here uh, just for, you know, people, just in case they rather watch here than YouTube, whatever. And as of recently, we now have a Facebook page, uh, Tab Nation Automation, link in the description below. I just launched this. This is just a place where, you know, I post some of my videos that just came out. But I also put like some little fun things like here's a, a quote from Scott Adams, uh, the creator of the comic book Dilbert. The fastest way to get a programmer to solve a problem is declare that the problem is unsolvable. And I love that because I've been told that many times and I'm like, I have to figure this out and prove them wrong. Like, and it's not like I'm trying to be mean. It's just like 
I like the idea of a challenge when I'm told it's impossible. It's not to throw it in their face. It's just like, ooh, an unsolvable problem? I'm, I'm game. Let's go. Now, outside of the Tab Nation universe, maybe like an extension of the Tab Nation universe, if you need help or looking for resources, my favorite is Reddit. Um, there's obviously the auto hockey subreddit, great place to ask questions, script help, you know, expand on my idea or what do you guys think about this or that? Just a great place. There are a few others. This is the main one. Um, there, a lot of people there don't really like gaming questions being asked, especially if they're multiplayer. So there is this one. It's called, uh, the other auto hockey Reddit, auto hockey gaming. And this is where you ask about gaming questions and, uh, more specifically with auto hockey and this one's pretty new i'll just throw it out there there's only 16 members but it's pretty new um but uh auto hockey memes so it's a place to kind of post like coding memes and stuff as you see here there's a bunch of different things uh, yeah so then obviously there is the auto hockey forms honestly this is probably the one i use by far the least uh just because there's so much stuff on there it's a great place to find answers you know, a lot of times when I Google something, it brings me here. But as far as asking for help, it's it can be hit and miss depending on what you're asking just because it's going to be a little slower of a response sometimes versus like Reddit or uh, the Auto Hotkey Discord, which if you want in the main subreddit, there is a link to the Discord channel uh, if you want like live support, I guess you could say. Then there are multiple Facebook groups actually on Auto Hockey's. So right here you can see there's three. There's Auto Hockey right here then there's a second one called AHK auto hockey these are by far the most popular ones uh, and then there's one just called auto hockey now this one has the least amount of members and only has just under 800 uh, but there's those and then depending on what region you're in there are some like I know there is an auto hockey Brazil group uh, there's a Korean group, and I'm sure there's more out there. So if you want something that's maybe not in English, more native to your uh, area, you might be able to find an auto hockey where people are, you know, talking in, you know, the Korean language and Spanish or whatever uh, region you're in. Last, uh, if you use LinkedIn, there is my page, Tab Nation. Feel free to connect with me on there. I post stuff from time to time on here. Not as often, uh, but there is a auto hockey group. There's actually two, uh, but the one that's called auto hockey, there's like basically nobody really in there, but auto hockey programming, if it loads, is basically the uh, more popular one. Once again, you know, it's LinkedIn. There's not going to be as much activity going on here, but if you like LinkedIn, you know, definitely check that out. Yeah, if there's any other resources uh, having to do with auto hockey and like help people posting about it, definitely let me know in the comments below if there's something I missed or I've never even heard of. Uh, that'd be great. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on the next video. And thanks for watching the Tab Nation Universe episode.